content supply chain these days is a, is, a, is a really hot topic because we see that companies need to create more and more content at scale. And companies are struggling with this because they, have, they work in silos, they work with external teams, and it's very hard to, well, to create that content at scale. So this edition of the Content Supply Chain Bootcamp uh, brings together uh, brand um, um, and marketing and digital teams. And during the two days, we will have some, uh, some interactive workshops, some deep dives, and this will help, let's say, the people uh, streamline their content supply chain. So the bootcamp that I joined today was my first bootcamp. Uh, I, can, I think it can really improve the customer journey that we're creating. Now that I have a better idea of what the products actually do and have hands-on experience with the products, it's going to be much easier for me to know what's possible. Well, what I take away from this bootcamp is uh, basically how you can uh, set up an end-to-end -end process and I want to also implement that in my organization. So bring the people together that should work together. We're already using a lot of uh, Adobe tools or starting to use the Adobe tools. And I think seeing how they're used out of the box now helps us also get more out of the tools and challenge how they are currently used today. We've been doing boot camps for quite a few years already and the purpose really is to allow our prospects, our customers to meet each other and to have a real interaction with us to touch the tools and really learn more about the value of the solutions by not only just using them and listening to us but also by brainstorming with each other. Um, and it means that customers really like to have this kind of interaction with each other and if that helps us to help them to understand what we can deliver to them, then that is why it is important. I thought it was really cool to see what you guys are doing with, uh, with Firefly and Generative AI, and I'm really looking forward to seeing what Adobe is going to come up next for, uh, for that, yes. 